Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm eating Chick-fil-A for 24 hours. This was highly requested and I love a challenge so I'm excited. It's currently 9.45 and I'm hungry so I'm gonna Uber Eats breakfast and I will see you when it gets here. And before we start, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe for more videos. Breakfast is acquired and it smells so good. I've only had it once in my life so I can't wait to try it again. I got the chicken minis and hash browns because I love carbs. Like I don't get keto people, bread is life. Let's start, you're joking. This would happen to me. I can't even do the five second rule because this is a New York City street. I feel like that was a sign from God telling me to knock off a few calories. They are so cute and tiny. Oh my God, incredible. I wanna marry this, the bun is so buttery and good and the chicken is chef's kiss. You guys know me and I barely give 10 out of 10s, but this is a 10. Also, there's chicken in here, so that means it's healthy, right? Now let's try the hash browns and I'm gonna be careful with them because I can't afford to lose one. They're very crispy. Yum. When I die, bury me in these. I swear there's crack in here because it's so good. So crunchy and have the perfect potato flavor. I think hash browns are my favorite form of potato. I'm giving these a nine out of 10 only because the McDonald's ones are better. I love complaining, so the one thing I'll complain about is I wish there was a little more salt on them. Also to my haters, I do chew the food. I just cut it because it's boring to watch me chew for 10 seconds. Anyway, if anyone's wondering why I'm filming outside, it's because my room in my apartment is the size of a shoebox and it looks like a prison cell. But I'm gonna finish this amazing breakfast and I will see you for lunch. So good. Hey guys, I'm back for lunch and I Uber Eats it again because I'm lazy. I got the nuggets, mac and cheese, and french fries. I don't like the fries, but maybe I'll change my mind. Nope, I don't change my mind. I don't get how people like them. They don't have the crispiness I desire. And they need to take a trip to Flavortown because they're so bland. These are a two out of 10. Now we got the mac and cheese and let's do a cheese pool. Or maybe not. <laughs> that was really sad. I forgot how good this was. Mm, this is hitting the spot. The crust is so good and it's school cafeteria vibes in the best way. Whatever chemicals they put in this mac and cheese, it's fantastic, eight out of 10. So good. Now we got the nuggets. Good as always. Again, <laughs> gotta protect them, but the breading is everything. These are a 9.5 out of 10. For me, the fast food nuggets goes McDonald's, Chick-fil-A, Popeyes, and then Wendy's and KFC Tide, and then Burger King. But I also wanna try this hack that I saw on TikTok where you put fries and then mac and cheese, nuggets, and then some Chick-fil-A sauce, and ooh, it's thick. And then we mix it up. Can't wait to wash this later tonight. Oh wow, this looks like a heart attack. Let's get a bite of everything. Oh no. Tastes very soggy, I don't recommend trying this out. Also got a bunch of sauces and I wanna do a sauce battle. First is Chick-fil-A and the color turns me off. Disgusting, it's very heavy on the mustard, two out of 10. Zesty buffalo, mmm. It has a nice kick to it, nine out of 10. Polynesian, way too sweet and I hate the soy in here, three out of 10. Ketchup, the love of my life. 10 out of 10, I love the sweetness and it makes the fries edible. But fun fact, I did not eat ketchup until a year ago because when I was 10, a girl squirted a ketchup packet like this one onto my white Juicy Couture shirt. So I was traumatized because of the smell. Ranch. It tastes like sour yogurt, four out of 10. But anyway, I'm gonna finish these nuggets because they're amazing and I will see you for dinner. So good. Back for dinner and I wish they served breakfast every day because I could go for round two of those hash browns. But I will see you with the food in three, two, one. That was probably a horrible transition, but I got the grilled chicken nuggets and a cookie. I actually order these all the time and they're really good if you're looking for a healthy option. They're so flavorful and don't even need sauce, but maybe I'm not the best person to judge because I'm white and like my stuff plain. But 10 out of 10 recommend. Also guys, I can't explain how awkward it is filming outside in New York City. So many people walk by me and stare at me. Purple and anyway, last up we have the chocolate chip cookie and I've never had it before, but it looks really good. There's so many chocolate chunks. Cheers. Mm. Oh wow. Crumble who? They need to take notes from Chick-fil-A because this cookie is everything. It's not too sweet and so chocolatey. I'm in love. Mm, good job, Chick-fil-A. 
hands down a 10 out of 10 and if there was raisins in here it would be in a million out of 10. But anyways that's gonna wrap up the video thank you so much for watching besides the fries everything was really good and if you have any video ideas for me let me know in the comments and i'll see you in the next video bye